Everybody's been asking me about the changes in the deer hunt regulations here in Michigan for 2024. And I went to the state website, to the DNR, and I I printed out the <laughs> the summary and it's like 75 pages. So I, I, got, I think I got to page three and I gave up. I did come up with all of the, the, the major changes for this year and I wanna put them out to you, make it quick and easy in a nutshell so that you guys are aware of what's changed really simple so i've got some notes here uh you'll see me look down occasionally but i, I want to make sure that you guys get a straight up answer of exactly what's changed for this year so let's start with the upper peninsula the first major crazy change for the upper peninsula is a three-point antler restriction uh, that's been put into effect on a single deer license for dmu 122. Uh, the eastern central dmu 351 is closed to antlerless deer hunting completely can't shoot does there at all this year. No antlerless deer in, in 351. Uh, the Western Central DMU 352 is uh, using a, uh, when you're using an antlerless universal license, you must also have an antlerless deer hunting access permit. Uh, there would be 500 access permits available and you have to apply for them. July 15th through August 15th is the application period. Today is August 12th, so if you are intending to shoot a antlerless deer in that area and have not applied, you better get on it quick because you only got three days left. So get that taken care of. For each deer that you harvest in the UP in that uh, uh, DMU 352, you'll actually need an access permit plus the universal uh, antlerless hunting license. So you need both in order to, in order to take an antlerless deer in, in unit 352. Uh, antlerless deer can still be taken during the archery season on the single or the combo license all the way up through December 10th of 2024. And that's for units 17, 21, 27, 36, 117, 149, 152, 249, 252, and 349. I don't expect you to remember all those. Come back, watch the video, pause, whatever you got to do to get those numbers. Uh, but that's what's available this year. So that covers the major changes for the Upper Peninsula. Let's move on to the Lower Peninsula and things get a little bit crazier here. Uh, let's start with the three things that have not changed this year. What has not changed is the baiting ban. All the baiting restrictions are unchanged from last year. Uh, all of the antler point restrictions are also unchanged. So for those of us here in, the, in, in Zone 2 in the Upper Lower Peninsula, we have, uh, uh, we have not got any changes on the antler point restrictions. And the combo license is still in effect for 2024. Good for you to shoot two antler to deer, two bucks as we would call them. And that's probably going away next year from the sounds of it. So you, this year you can still shoot your two bucks with your combo tag. Uh, the biggest change, we'll jump into the changes now for this year, the biggest change for the Lower Peninsula for 2024 is that the archery season has been extended to January 31st of 2025 for just the following counties, Huron, Kent, Lapeer, Macomb, Oakland, Sanilac, St. Clair, Tuscola, Washtenaw, and Wayne counties. So for all of those counties, the, the uh, archery season has been extended all the way through January 31st of 2025. So if you live there, great. If you have access to property there, great. If you don't have access to property there, find some, you can hunt all the way through the end of January, all the way through January 31st. Uh, another big change is the entire Lower Peninsula uh, may now use any legal firearm during the muzzleloader season. So when we get into muzzleloader season in December, you can use any legal firearm. So for those of you in the Southern zone, that also, uh, you know, in that limited zone down there, you must follow the equipment regulations for the, the, for the firearm deer season. Uh, so you still, you know, can't use a, a, a 30 out six rifle in that zone, but follow all the regular restrictions, everything that's set up for the firearm season. Uh, those are all gonna be totally legal to use still through muzzleloader season, as well as the Northern Lower Peninsula is now able to use those as well this year. You can use any legal firearm uh, for that, so that's a, that's a that's fantastic. I'm excited. Uh, early and late firearm seasons will also now include public land. 
So the early season is uh, September 21st and 22nd this year. And the late firearm season is December uh, 16th through January 1st. And so for, for uh, both of those seasons will now include public land. It's been private land only for the last 15 years or so. And now that includes public land, which is uh, great news. Um, and then another, another extended late antlerless season. So January 2nd to the 12th of 2025, uh, you can purchase as a license specific for that season, that 11 day season for $5. And it is for the following counties, which is pretty much all of Southern Lower Michigan. And I'll read them off to you because I couldn't remember them all, so I did write those down. That would be Allegan, Barry, Bay, Calhoun, Eaton, Genesee, Gratiot, Hillsdale, Ingham, Ionia, Isabella, Jackson, Kent, Lapeer, Lenaway, Livingston, Macomb, Macosta, Midland, Monroe, Montcalm, Muskegon, Nuego, Oakland, Ottawa, Saginaw, St. Clair, Shiawassee, Wayne, and Washtenaw counties. So all of those counties will have a, another extended late antler list season, January 2nd to 12th, 2025. It will also include three other deer management units, 311, 312, and 332. So all of those zones are going to be open uh, for the late an, uh, extended late antler list season, January 2nd to 12th. So Lots of new opportunities. Ultimately, in a nutshell, what did the DNR just tell us with this? The, the National Re Natural Resources Commission. They want us to kill a lot of antlerless deer this year. So, they've extended seasons. They've made it special seasons. They've thrown stuff all the way out to the end of January. Boy, I'll tell you what, they taste just as good as a buck. You can still shoot two bucks with your combo license just like every year in the past. So, let's get out there. Let's do our part in the conservation and make Michigan great. Take care of some of those antlerless deer and fill those freezers. Thanks for joining me today. I'm Jason. You're watching Hunt in God's Country. Shoot straight. Keep the fire going.